So he got this lady and her baby up here. Okay. So she's like, please, please just spare my child. And Dio's like, right. <laughs> bitch, please, who you think I is? Your baby daddy? I ain't got time to take care of your damn kid. So he turns her into a zombie and makes her eat her baby. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Hey, no! Hey, no! This What's up with you YouTube and welcome back baby to another reaction video bro Today we're gonna react to CJ the champ Dio the generational hero Generation, I said hero. What the fuck, nigga? Hater. Oh my god, I fucked up. Already. <laughs> uh, guys, y'all already know the video, bro. It's a CJ and Champ video, bro. It's gonna be lit, bro. It, it's it's gonna be lit. You already know. You're gonna keep us rolling with the commentary, bro. The jokes, the laughter. Niggas, a wild man. But <laughs> yeah, if I do, y'all already know what the business is. Like, comment, subscribe, click that bell icon so you know because we're we pumping into the game, into the game, into the game. And please share the video, man. But a further ado, let's get into this thing. Yiddy. Take a step, I dare you. So he tries to climb it, but he keeps on climbing the same stair over. I forgot what he did <laughs> like that, bro. <laughs> Yo, D.O. D bro, really D.O. was OP. That nigga was OP as fuck, bro. Like, like, dead ass. For no, for no fucking apparent reason. That nigga was OP as fuck. Over and over and over again. Dio's like, wow, what's wrong? You on 400 pink or something? You know what, while you struggle with your lag spikes, I'm gonna sit in this chair that's conveniently here, yeah. right over this staircase. Like... The nigga is childish, bro. The nigga is not childish. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it, it is finally time to return to the round table, table of Black, Black Air Force Black activity. Yes, and our yes. greatest challenger yet has finally approached. Deal. The judge to take his rightful seat at this sacred table of menaces. And it is none other than the greatest Fire hater Fire. in anime, anime history, Dio. Dio! <laughs> Yo, Dio really is kind of like one of my favorite. I mean, I, niggas were like, ah, that's typical nigga. Of course Dio is your favorite. I don't know. I just, I just like, like I, I, I always like the evil niggas, bro. I always like villains, bro. I mean, the heroes are okay, which is cool, bro. I don't, be, I, I like them too, but the villain is really what captures what I like about the show. If the villain is a gruesome ass nigga, don't give a fuck. I'm loving it. I'm, I'm, I'm in love with it. Like, like ain't no cap. I, I'm gonna love the fuck out of that shit, bro. Like, they do their thing, bro. They, they always make the main character suffer. And, that's some good to my heart. <laughs> the king of hating ass niggas. The pettiest of the petty. Probably one of the greatest ops of all time. Yeah, this man is truly Black Air Force incarnate. So, bro, I ain't even gonna waste no time with this one. So, y'all already know we got the evidence on that. And it is finally time to observe the generational hater. So, without further ado, exhibit A. All right, ladies and gentlemen. I now present to you exhibit A. Dio Brando. So to understand why this man has the most out-of-pocket hatred, we gotta go all the way back to 1880. So Dio started off in the trenches. Man was playing chess for money, getting beat up in the bar, and living in this old-ass shack, so bro hella down bad. So his dad is dying, right? So he tells him, <laughs> no, I, listen here, boy. When I die, take this letter to the Joestar family. Now you see them niggas owe me a debt. <laughs> I tell you, they some rich ass motherfuckers too. So you know what to do. Rob them niggas. Take every last set. Make Pappy proud. So he dies. So Dio's at the cemetery. He's like, hmm, 
About damn time your old ass died. I ain't gonna lie, I fucking hated you. You drove mama to die. You was a piece of shit. So you can eat a dick, old nigga. Pussy. <laughs> So later on, Dio pulls up to the Joestar mansion. So Jonathan's like, hi, my name's Jonathan. This is my dog, Danny. So Dio's like, that's your dog? Yeah, isn't he great? She is. I ain't fucking your dog, nigga. (laughs) Yo, I slipped forgot for a minute. This nigga kicked the shit out of this nigga's dog, yo. For for absolutely no reason, this nigga just said, fuck that nigga. It booted his. <laughs> oh my god, fuck, boy. D- Dio need, need counseling, nigga. They need, need fucking counseling or psychiatric or some shit. What the fuck, bro? <laughs> oh my god, bro. Somebody call Peter. This nigga just tried to eat the dog. dog. Bro ain't even been here for a minute. He already started Start shit. Keep- Look at him, bro. He already ready to scrap. So the dad come out and he like, yo, what are y'all doing? And Dio's like, oh, I am terribly sorry. That filthy animal was in my personal space. So George tells Jonathan, I right, listen, Dio's going to be living here from now on. So Jonathan goes over to touch his bag. But Dio grabs his hand and elbows him in the chest. So he comes down and he's like, listen, little nigga, this is my house now. I run this bitch. So I want to hear shit from your little spoiled ass. I'm about to make your life hell. So as time goes on, as they start living together, Jonathan's having this boxing match. So the ref's like, hey, uh, just to let you know, your opponent got changed. Huh? Huh? Yeah, you're going to be fighting him. Dio. Oh, my God. Oh, my (laughs) God. Round one. Fight. Fight. Let's get into it. Oh, my goodness. Ladies and gentlemen, he can't even hit him. And a beautiful body shot landed by Dio. And a beautiful right straight to the jaw. Yeah. Ew. <laughs> Yo, he tried to just fuck for this weed. <laughs> for the weed animation, this nigga is hella childish, yo. What the fuck? <laughs> Dude. I don't... Bro, jo- bro, he also couldn't do shit, bro. Just couldn't do a damn thing at all, bro. He was fucked up. He, he was getting his ass beat by Dio. <laughs> oh my god, yo, this man just watched him in front of his hometown. Exactly. So after Dio humiliated Jonathan, everybody started Jonathan started that nigga. talking to you know Arena and everything. So this Ooh. man Dio decided to do the, the pettiest shit. Ever. He pulls up on her and says, "Hey." You Jojo girl, he been looking a little happy lately, and I don't oh, like that, that a bit. Kiss this bitch. Oh my gosh, bro, this that man nigga... is so petty. He says, "Oh, you." Bro, the nigga straight pulled up and kissed this nigga's girl for absolutely no reason, just on the simple fact he don't like that nigga. He don't like. It. Do you know how fucking wild that shit is, bro? To come and test my bitch just because you see I'm happy, nigga. Bro, that's why Dio is the fucking greatest, greatest villain of all time, bro. That's why he's the greatest villain of all time, bro. Just off the simple fact. And then this nigga told his bitch afterwards, if Joseph didn't get a kiss from you first as being the first kisser, I'm the first kisser. It was me, Dio. And this nigga started monologuing this, bro. Like, come on, bro. How can you not love Dio? How can you not love fucking Dio? Come on, be 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 for real, bro. Be for real. You thought your first kiss was gonna be with JoJo? Nah, no, no, it, it was, was with me, me nigga. Yeah. Cut up Dio now. So later on, Jonathan ends up running up on Dio. Dio. And bro's like, how dare you raise your voice at me? You should learn some respect. So he elbows him in the nose. And bro's like, hey, hey, stupid little nigga. You just mad because I raised up your girl real good. But then Jonathan just started laying the hands on him. Hit this man with the dipsy roll. So Dio's like, yeah. And I said, John, I mean, I said, Joseph, my fuck. I mean, Jonathan. Bro, I'm tired, bro. I'm going off like three hours of fucking sleep. <laughs> give me give me a break, bro. Give me a break. Fuck. <laughs> oh, damn you lay your hands on my beautiful face. I swear to God, I'm going to shake your ass. But then George ends up stopping him. So Dio's like, right. 
think you're getting away with this. I don't take L's. So later on, the butler is walking outside, and he's at the furnace, and he sees this box. So he's like, oh, it's just a box. So he lights the furnace, but then something starts the dog. So then later on in the day, they're having a funeral, because the dog was in the furnace. Like, like, how evil can this nigga get, bro? Like, like, be for real. How? <laughs> this shit is so devious. And he just doing it all the simple fact that he just don't like that nigga. Like, bro, like, I, I, it's crazy, bro. I, I aspire to be the most hated nigga like this nigga, bro. I aspire to be, to hate on a nigga as much as this nigga. I want to be the number one hating nigga in the nation, goddammit. God damn, bro. <laughs> oh my god, bro. This man, Dio, put the dog in the furnace to burn him. Oh my god. So a couple of years pass and they end up becoming friends. Friends. Well, not really because this man Dio is fake as hell. So George Joestar has gotten sick and he has a very bad cough. So the thing is, Dio has been giving this man medicine the whole time but not his real medicine. This man has been poisoning him the entire time. And then Jonathan figured out, wait a minute. Didn't your dad have the same symptoms too? Exactly. Oh my God, you killed your father. Yo, this nigga so then wild. Dio's like, are you trying to press me right now? So he ends up swinging on Jonathan, but Jonathan just ate that yeah. John. Boy was like, bro, you best get to stepping out of my house. So he ends up throwing him off the balcony. So Jonathan's like, you a fake ass nigga. And I'm calling the cops. So Dio ends up dipping, but he takes the stone mask. So later on, he out here drunk as hell. So he ends up running into these two dudes. So bro yeah. smacks him in the jaw. Ooh. And he's like, mm, this is the perfect time. Time to test out this stone mask. So he puts it on this dude and runs him into the other dude so it stabs him. So then the mask activates with the blood. And he done turned this man into a whole vampire. So the dude starts to choke him out, but that top of the morning end up getting his ass. So after this, Dio pulls back up to the house. So Jonathan runs up on him. He was like, yeah, I done figured out you've been poisoning my dad. So Dio's trying to plead his case. Then Speedwagon in the corner like, I, 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 I don't trust that nigga with his old cap and ass. And then George is behind the curtains. So Dio's like, well, I ain't got nothing to lose now. Bring me that ass. So he ends up stabbing George. And he's like, yes, it's Marvin time. <laughs> oh, you, bro, bro, what the fuck, man? I need to go watch JoJo's back again, bro. Like, just with it, just the Dio section, bro, because this shit is fucking hilarious, bro. This nigga didn't give a fuck, nigga. <laughs> he didn't give a fuck at all. So they end up shooting him, and Dio ends up going out the window. So about a minute later, uh, while everybody nigga, thinking he's dead, they're like, uh, why is his body fighting? gone? And he rips this man's head clean off. Shit, and now he's a whole ass vampire. vampire. So bro just started bodying Body. everybody in the house. <laughs> so then he goes over to fight <laughs> He has to start with the weemies. This nigga put strike, bro. Get the fuck. CJ, catch your, catch your days, nigga. What the fuck, bro? You fucking hilarious, dude. You <laughs> Jonathan, but he ends up burning him. But obviously, that ain't do nothing. He just shrugged it off. That shit off, nigga. Yo, look at this man here. walking Walkie. up the wall like a Louis Vuitton <laughs> model. What the me, nigga. Nigga said Kim Kahn got shit on me. me and look nigga. at Jonathan. He like, oh my god. His zestiness is too strong. <laughs> so man's had to tackle him <laughs> all the way from the roof and impale this man <laughs> on a spear. Hey. So he could finally burn the right, ash, right, but nigga. obviously then that's again, not going to work. Hello? Okay, right so back. after this, Dio does a bunch of shenanigans. First off, this man turned Jack the Ripper, Ripper into a vampire. vampire. So then he goes over and takes over this entire village, turned basically almost everybody into it's zombies, a, kidnapped this little boy's sister, stepped on uh, this dog. dog. What the f*** is that, bro? Like, honest to God. And then... Oh boy, this is probably the worst thing this man ever did. So he got this lady and her baby up here. Okay. So she's like, please, please just spare my child. 
And Dio's like, right. <laughs> bitch, please, who you think I is? Your baby daddy? I ain't got time to take care of your damn kid. So he turns her into a zombie and makes her eat her baby. Hey, hey yo, what the fuck? Hey, no! Hey, no, this nigga is Ain't no fucking way, dude. Ain't no fucking way, dude. I, I, bro, it's been a fuck, dude. It's been a minute since I watched this. So like now that I'm, I'm, I'm like looking at it again. I'm like, God damn, nigga. I, I really, I really forgot how bad this nigga was. I knew he was fucking bad, but nigga, like this nigga is fucking wilding. Yo, like, two, <laughs> this bitch is a zombie. I, I can't even, uh, fuck the damn man. It, it doesn't even matter, bro. It, it doesn't even fucking matter. <laughs> this bitch is a zombie and make her eat her own child. Yo, that is fucking wild, yo. <laughs> That's some next level shit, man. I'm not even gonna lie. No, 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 I, I'm done, no. This is probably the first time I've ever done this, but I don't care. G go ahead and sit oh, down, me. bro. I, I, go I, ahead and sit down. This man. is the most demonic <laughs> shit I, ever seen in my I life. have ever seen. Besides, besides when Boo faded is in heaven, this, this is this right, right behind, behind it. it. What Literally. the actual fuck? Oh. Nah, bro. bro we ain't even like, with Exhibit A, and I just had to go ahead bro. and sit the man's, bro. I know. I had to give this. Uh, hey, bro, he already earned his spot. He needed to be in this bitch. A long time ago, <laughs> bro. Can that that that, bro? What the? I, I ain't got words for this shit, bro. <laughs> Man, a fast pass. He skipped the line. Bro, I mean, yeah, I'll spare him. I. Uh, so after a bunch of traumatic, traumatic ass events, this. Jonathan finally pulls up on Deal. So he's like, "Wow, congratulations! You beat all of my sub bosses. Tell me, tell me real quick, how's that Zeppelin pack hitting?" Oh my god. So then they about to scrap, but Dyer comes in and he's like, no, this is it's my fight. fight. So he jumps up Damn, to kick him, ass, but Dio grabs both of his it's legs like, and makes him do the split. split. Then he freezes it's his entire, entire body. Fight. Then he says, you know, no. men shouldn't do the splits, it's right? Because that's how you break your knees. Yeah. Yo, bro shattered this man's body. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? I can't even keep my bro. My lenses are falling out because of this nigga, bro. My lens is falling out of my fucking glasses because this nigga. God don't even want me to see this menace, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Dude, what the yo? Come on, bro. This nigga's cut this nigga and flipped this nigga in half. We ain't cut him. What he basically did? He broke this nigga in half between his nuts. Yo. I don't know. <laughs> fuck, bro. So then Jonathan comes in and slices him in half <laughs> with his sword. He didn't give a like, fuck. He fixed <laughs> himself. really thought that old bullshit Bullshit's was going to work. work Say psych right now. Let me tell you something right now. Nah, Yo, I'm on training. is ass. Nigga. You are ass. Nigga. So then Dio jumps at him, but Jonathan nigga. hits him with this tentacle. Punch. Fuck. It feels like impossible. Got you. I need a black so some time passes. So Jonathan and Arena end up getting married. So while they are on their honeymoon, Jonathan ends up seeing one of Dio's assistants. So he runs after him and they end up going to this casket. So bro opens the casket and he pulls Dio's head out of the casket. Then Dio says, happy honeymoon, nigga. Hey, hey, oh, yo, I just want to give my congratulations, even though I did steal your girl's first kiss. Congratulations, my bad. I couldn't make the wedding, but I knew I would have been your best man, right? Tell me, tell me something real quick. How my lips taste? Oh. So, <laughs> How my lip? Yo, that's wild as fuck, bro. Come on, dude. What the fuck? <laughs>
Bro, laser beams this Just man, turns everybody it's, on this ship into zombies. zombies, and ends up jacking this it's man's it's body. body. And he rested at the bottom of the ocean for but years, 1889 to 1983. God, yeah, that was damn. Exhibit A, and it's finally time to move on to Exhibit, exhibit B. B. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Exhibit B, Dio. So after Dio came out of his casket in 1983, this is when he took stuff to the next level. Bro was on his Kanye arc. Nigga jumped off his last name and said, you will know me as capital D, capital I, capital O. Man was going around beating cheeks, beat some cheeks made Jorno, beat some old cheeks, had three other ugly ass kids with Jonathan's body. And he would just drink their blood after he finished beating their cheeks. Then he ended up meeting Poochie, his hating ass successor. Okay. Passed down his hating ass ideology <laughs> to this nigga. Got his stand from Inya the Hag's ugly ass. And yo, this man was just so mysterious at the beginning of Stardust Crusaders. You ain't even see his face till like 45 Five episodes, episodes later. later. Everybody just had stories of him. I, that's how much of a menace that nigga really was. Bro, you didn't even... Bro, niggas didn't know who the fuck Dio was. They just knew the name, nigga. Do you know how much of a hating, evil, conniving, legendary-ass nigga you gotta be, bro? For niggas not to even know how you look, bro. They know all just stories of your fucking name. D-I-O. D-O. Nigga, they ain't give a fuck, bro. They, they, they was terrified of this nigga, bro. And this nigga was that forced to be wrecking with, bro. He really was. Meeting him. Avdol was like, yeah, yeah, I saw that nigga. I was walking up the stairs, right, and I saw this big motherfucker. He was licking his lips and shit. I was like, hell, I'm getting into that freaky shit, you feel me? So I jumped out the window. I hit the damn Hey, Avdol was bullshit, bro. Hey, Avdol turned into a fucking track star, nigga. I don't blame him, bro. When you see that nigga Dio, you see that little star slip on that nigga neck. I'm dip, I'm doing the 400 meter dash, nigga. Oh my fuck, bro. I'm out this bitch. I am doing the dash, nigga. No. Oh, step it. Then they ran into Polnareff. Polnareff was like, yeah, I remember that nigga. Yo, he brainwashed me and shit. Man, took me into this room and he had the gypsy ball and shit. Nigga was like, I can tell your future. And he brainwashed this man Kakyoin too. But nah, nah, it's what he did to whole horse. While Dio was reading a book, this man really tried to pull a gun on him. Then when he's about to shoot him, Dio's like, are you positive you want to pull that trigger? Then bro teleports right behind him. And he was like, ooh la la. I liked how you pulled that gun out on me. We should do this more often. Dog had this man shaking in his boots. So when they finally get to Egypt after facing all the sub bosses, Polnareff ends up walking up on this staircase and finally finds Dio. So Dio's like, wow, congratulations, y'all made it. I mean, you down two people, but uh, congratulations. Hey, but I'll tell you this though, you walk up that step, you're dead. Okay. Take a step, I dare you. So he tries to climb it, but he keeps yeah, on climbing the same stuff, stair nigga. over and over that and over crazy, again. Bro. Dio's like, wow, what's wrong? You on 400 ping or some shit? Me? You know what, why <laughs> you struggle with your lag spikes? I'm gonna sit in this chair that's conveniently here right over this staircase. So then everybody else finally ends up coming in. So Dio's like, hmm, the sunlight, I must retreat. So about a minute later, they climb this staircase and they see this casket. So Joseph's like, hey, ugly ass this boy, open the casket. Nigga. So he opens the casket that's and he sees himself that's in the that's casket. That shit is wild. So they like, oh shit. Hey, Joseph. Shut up, nigga. Yo, the fact that this man Dio put this man in the that's casket it. like that. Man's killed him in the blink of an I. eye and shoved him in the casket. Bro, do you know? <laughs> And the nigga was just standing there, bro. And he, he fucking one shot at this nigga and threw him in the damn casket. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that, that nigga too quick, bro. They don't tell me that. You think it can stop time anyway? This nigga. Shit's wild, bro. Just so he could give him a little scare. So they are running away and deals like, ah, yes. The hunt begins. 
So later on, we're <laughs> walking down the street, and he's like, hmm, I like this car. So the dog's like, hey, what you think you're doing, cat? This car belongs to the senator. But he just breaks his arm and hops in the car. So then he looks at the senator, rips out his two front teeth, and he says, mm, looks like you got a date with the tooth fairy tonight. Now get your ass in the front seat and drive. So while they driving, they hit a traffic jam. So the senator's like, yo, I can't drive. Then Dio says, uh, you know the sidewalk's wide open, right? So he starts driving on the sidewalk and Dio says, floor it. So he oh, this man run over all these people just to get out of a traffic jam. Jesus Christ. So he finally ends up catching up to him. So he tries to use That shit is funny. He said, nigga, oh, traffic jam. The fuck is that? Nigga, you don't floor this bitch. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? We'll splash on him, but Dio just looks at it. He's like, wow, so pretty. Get the shit out of my face. This bro sucks. So while they keep on driving, he blows the senator through the car. So they end up dipping and going on top of the roof, so Dio follows him. So then Kakyoin sets up this trap. So it's like, ha ha, I have you now. So show me your stand ability. So Dio's like, I did witness true hatred. So then Dio goes over to him and says, This is my stand ability. Zoratio. I can stop time and ratio anybody in the amount of mere seconds. In just a blink of an eye, I could freeze your account and gain hundreds. No, thousands of likes before you even do what? Nigga. Now, I'm about to fist you. And no pause. <laughs> because we're already paused. Uh, Resume. Ah! So Joseph was like, oh, oh nah. nah. What's the best, best thing I know how to do? Two. Hit the it's jet just and together. get the step. So while he's chasing Joseph down, he ends up punching him off this roof. So Joseph sees Jotaro and he's like, oh my God, my nigga, do not come Jump any closer. closer. So then Dio sees him and he's like, mm, both of them at the same time. I'm on in this mid ass bloodline. So then Dio comes down and just starts walking towards him, smacking cats, smacking people like they mannequins. And he's like, hmm, I could only used to give one L at a time, but now I can give two. It'll eventually be 10 to 20 to thousands. So I leave you with my party gift. And with that, Ratio. So then he looks at Jotaro and he's like, hmm, I'm on your ass next too, little nigga. So Jotaro starts walking towards him. So he's like, huh, oh, nah. so you're approaching me? You trying to fall uh, off like your granddaddy nigga? nigga? <laughs> but he's like, nah, I got to get closer <laughs> to you so I can beat the <laughs> shit out, out your ass. ass. So Dio's like, mm, I like that. I like that. Bruh, bruh, I'm not going to lie, bro. That, this scene was like the most like talked about scene for the longest, bro. That shit was fire, bro. Joseph didn't give a fuck, nigga. He, he jo I mean, Joe Toy didn't give a fuck, bro. I don't know why I keep fucking up their names in between, bro. I, I'm in two. Joe Toy didn't give a fuck, nigga. Hey, nigga said, squirt the fuck up there, nigga. I ain't running for no bitch ass, nigga, bro. We own, we own bumpers, nigga. We own bumpers. Come on now. We finna get it. Just fade. So they start bumping. Nah, and bop Dio bop. hits him with this nasty hook. Oh, and he's me. like, mm, that's what I used to hit your great great granddaddy with back in the day. Nigga. Now catch this ratio. Yo, so they keep on scrapping. So Joe oh. ends up punching him into this jewelry store. So while he's knocked out, he gets up and looks at the lady. And he's like, hey. Make yourself useful and fetch me my leg. So she started getting scared. So he said, "Bitch, hurry yeah, the yeah, fuck up and give me my goddamn leg." Yeah. So he ends up killing her and taking her blood. And he's like, "Oh, we just getting started, started nigga. You overgrown man child. I hope you're ready for a knife party." Bye. So then, bro, ended up throwing all of these not. knives at this just man. Like, can somebody please tell me where this man was storing Story. all of these knives? Exactly. At? Like, bro. for like, ain't no way that belt buckle handle. All all them knives. So he ended up. Stabbing him. So while he's on the ground, Dio's like, hmm, I guess I'll just kill him it with this rope. Well, sorry, but nigga. then Polnareff comes from the top rope. And then Dio does it again. Oh, that tickled. Go ahead, move to the side. Nigga. So then the cops pull, pull up. up. But Dio's like, really? Why get the fuck out <laughs> my face? Oh, oh, so then he starts controlling the other cop. 
And he's like, all right, I need you to aim right and precisely right there. So he makes him shoot him. And yo, this man is so determined to make sure that he is dead. He is lying on the ground trying to hear a heartbeat. Bro's like, I better not hit his head to take a breath. <laughs> Yo, he didn't give a fuck, bro. He, I, he, he, he hated the Joe Stars with a fucking passion, nigga. He hated them niggas with a passion, bro. It was so funny, bro. It was so funny. This nigga didn't like them niggas at all. It, <laughs> this nigga was like the fucking King Von <laughs> of the game, bro. <laughs> he, that nigga was not fucking with 63rd, nigga. But you know what? Just to make sure, I'm going to chop off his head with this road sign. But Jotaro ended up cracking that nigga upside the head. Fuck and he here. hit him so hard, he can't even move, move his legs. legs. So he's like, ah, oh, no, I got to go. go. So he ends up stopping go. time and hanging on to the back of his taxi. Then Jotaro I ain't ended up chasing him down and... Why is he in this so right now? He's so well, he like sitting in Dio's wow. line. But then this man Dio starts screaming at him. He's like, <laughs> you fool. You fell for my trap. Don't you remember this same street? So he ended up punching him to the street that Joseph's body is at. And he ends up taking all of his blood. He sucked that man dry. Pause. And now he's awakened Dio. And bro is a losing his mind. He's like, mm, yes, this glorious power is even giving me green lipstick. Oh, I can't wait to give you a big, fat, juicy kiss. So they start scrapping again. And Dio is just starting to go off the deep end now. I was like, this body is so no, juicy. juicy. Now run me my money, uh, nigga. Yeah. Oh, Jotaro man. ends up going flying, so Dio's like, oh, oh Jojo. Jo. <laughs> what the fuck you doing, you sack Son of shit? shit. <laughs> he was cracking. Yo, he was cracking that nigga, yo. Yo, he was cracking the fuck out of the rope. Oh, God damn. What the fuck? <laughs> With this final attack, I will finally end your mid ass bloodline for good. The ratio! Yo. So then he comes he down and he's like, hmm, mm -hmm. I'm about to create Chris, the greatest Chris, meme in anime history. history. One elf has passed. Two so elves have passed. passed. Three elves have passed. So we gotta be thinking, okay, yo, what is it's this man he's charging up? up? It's gotta be like a spirit Play bomb, bomb over a same guy. Get to the or I don't uh, know a dragon fist. No. No. This man does the, the unthinkable. A uh, fucking, a fucking steamroller, nigga. What, where did he go get a steamroller for? Where, from, bro? Where did he get one from? Like, that is crazy to me. This nigga wants to go get a steamroller and throw it on this nigga and start beating this shit. This nigga. Like, yo. Yo, bro. Like, that. Yeah, oh, oh. Uh. Fuck, man. Oh, no, no. Yeah, no, no, no. This man dropped a steamroller. He dropped no, a steamroller steam on him. Who in their right, right mind, mind would have thought of this? this? Bro saying, hmm, I could end his it's life a, with anything it, 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 right now. now. You know what I want to do? Still? I'm going to fly no, over gonna to this construction site. site. Grab, Grab this big ass steamroller. Steam fly it all, all the way, way back and slam it on this nigga. What? what? <laughs> that that is just doing the most. So then he starts beating, and for the longest no, time, no. for all these years, I thought, yo, he's beating the hell out of this with his fist. No, no, no take a closer no, no, look. No. He is beating he, this with what, his elbows. elbows. He got some elbow action. I didn't know he was beating it with his elbow. I thought it was his fist. Yo, just pay attention to this shit. What the fuck, yo? Yo, that nigga got some strong elbow. God damn. Hold on with this. Shit. So then he's like, it's no use! You, you fell it! Oh, oh, shit! <laughs> so then Dio's like, yes. <laughs> I finally Sorry, done it. After all oh, these DJ. long years. <laughs> ratio power! I have finally ratio the entire f***ing Joestar family. All you bitch ass niggas, now the f*** off! My ratio power has now exceeded to nine L. But then Dio ends up realizing he can't move because Jotaro just stopped stop time. time nigga. Like, impossible. This is. I'm going to keep it a butt, bro. To be honest, Jotaro should have lost. 
in my all opinion, Jotaro should have lost. Really, Jotaro won because of plot. It really was plot. He ain't made no sense. This nigga just out of nowhere just got the ability to stop time. Like, what the fuck? When did that happen, nigga? When? Come on now. Bullshit. So then he ends up picking him off the steamroller. So then they end up having one final clash. Trash. But then Jotaro Jotaro hit him with the counter. Why you have so much then he says, you know, man, there's only one reason why you lost. You just simply pissed me off. Get off my family, dick. So, yeah, uh, I mean, I already sat the man. So what more could I say? I mean, I could get into some of the stuff that happens in part six, but that would be getting into spoilers for anime only. So I'm not going to do all that. But uh, yeah, bro, this man is a menace. This is a demon incarnate. Man tormented this family for damn near 100 years, made a lady eat her own child, and along with dropping a steamroller on a nigga. No, pack your bags. Bro, pass this test with ease. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, I right. forgot to record that outro, so I'll just leave y'all with this. <laughs> bro, oh my god, appreciate this, dude, bro. Yo, that, that shit is wild, nigga. That shit is fucking wild. Dude, this shit that Dio did is unimaginable. This nigga's been torturing these niggas for a hundred some years, nigga. <laughs> And he still loved it. He hated them niggas. Hated they fucking ass with a passion, bro. He, he hated all them niggas. Every bloodline. He didn't give a fuck, nigga. He didn't care. He wanted them niggas eradicated, nigga. Bro. <laughs> oh, that was CJ Chap, bro. If you want to see me rant to any more of his ear, bro, let me know in the comments down below, man. Let me know. Man. Please talk to me. I got y'all. Anybody else, y'all know what I'm saying. But... <laughs> I'm gonna do y'all know what the business is, bro. Jay Killer's out this time, man. Peace.